he dreamed of that which never has been known. He dreamed of that which never has been known. He grasped at that which never has been won. That is the power of life, the urge, the impulse, the strength also of life. It chased into an Elysian memory the charm that flee from the heart's soon lost the light. It dared the force that slays, the joys that hurt. So that is the thing, you see, life, yeah. The joy that hurt, the foes that slays, it dares. The image, the shape of unaccomplished things and the summons to search and transmuting dance and passion tendency, the course of love and the wild beast ramp and roam with beauty and life. So this is the Greek image, Sersian island where Sarsi, the use of a man, she will turn people into swine and make them the slave all the while. But it was only Odysseus who could master her and subdue her, you see. So she is a Sarsi. <laughs> Transmuting dance and passion's tenancy of the course of love and the wild beast ramp and roam with beauty and life. So she allows every kind of thing activity. That is the power of life. Expression, exp what is dull, inert, what is locked in matter, somehow she wants to bring out, irrespective of the consequences. Give breath, give life to them. What happens? That is not her concern. She is really a brava. She has dared into matter and done all that thing. It brought its cry and surge of opposite power. You see, this is the point, you see. She can do that. And because of it, matter become, became alive, breathing. That is the power of life. Its moments of the touch of luminous flame, its flame ascensions and sky fish vast attempts, its fiery towers of dream, Build on the winds. <laughs> so she, she is building up, you see, on the dreams. Fire towers of dream build in the wind and is sinking to the darkness. And the, so all these things are there, up, down. You see. And is sinking towards the darkness and abyss. It's honey of tenderness, it's sharp wine of hate. The opposite, she doesn't bother. Is changes of sun and cloud of laughter and tears. Is bottomless danger pits and swallowing gulls. Is fear and joy. So on the one hand you got sky fish attempts. On the other hand you got dangerous pits there you see. Is fear and joy and ecstasy and despair. Is occult wizardries. Is simple lines and great communions and uplifting moves, his faith in heaven, his intercourse with hell. In fact, that is possible only because of life. She is able to link up these two. Otherwise, matter would not have awoken to his breathing possibility. So she is seeing now the play of life. In fact, the whole description which is there in the Ashwapati Yuga, covering three or four cantos, Savitri is now seeing that in the inner world, what is in the hierarchical world, she is seeing now in the inner world, in the inner domain. These powers are not blunt with dead weight of earth. So they are real powers to do this or do that. I mean, there is a question of morality, no ethics, nothing. This is the thing which has got to be done and done. Consequences, we shall see later on. These powers were not blunt with the dead weight of earth. They gave ambrosious taste and poisonous sting. So they were not dull, you see. <laughs> there was an azure in the gaze of life. They saw heaven blue 
in the gray air of night. See, that is a miracle. Why she is doing all that? Because she sees in the gray of night the possibility of a blue heaven. In the darkness of night, a new blue heaven can open out. She sees that and therefore there is an ardor in that. How it will happen? She does not know at the moment. But she sees that and she is working in her own way. Unhindered, without any inhibition. She is exercising her force, her power fully. The impulses Godward sword and passions wing, that is because of her. Minds quick paced thoughts floated from their high necks. A glowing splendor of an iris remain, a perure of pure intuitions light, a flame foot gallop they could imitate. Minds voices mimicked inspirations stress, its actors of infallibility, its speed and lightning heavenly of God. It is because of her this has become possible. Minds quick paced thought. See now, these, these are creatures. Mind floated from their high necks, glowing splendor of an iris mane. So they are carrying the mane also. A perure of pure intuition's light supplier, a flame foot gallop that could imitate what minds, voices mimic inspiration stress. They could mimic the way the inspiration would come and move. The gallop of minds is repeating the way the inspiration would come, mimicking. It's excess of infallibility, it's stress, excess is stress that it must happen, it should be so. It's speed and lightning heaven leaps for the God. It can imitate even that, you see, because of life. A trench and blade that shows the days of doubt. At the same time, it casts doubt. A sword of discernment seemed almost divine. Discernment. Sharp knife of discernment. That is what is called Dakshina. You see, we have seen last night earlier, no? four powers, discernment, intuition, inspiration, revelation. She is a goddess. The sword of discernment seemed almost divine. Yet all that knowledge was a borrowed sense. It is not the true knowledge. It has come from the supramental, all these layers. Even revelation. The form that came were not heaven's native births. His fusions, dangerous and absolute, could mingle poison with the wine of God. Because they were borrowed, therefore this mixture was possible. Poison with wine. Because they were not pure enough. Mind, yes, it brings some knowledge, but then it gets vitiated by life, by other elements of the slow nature. Could mingle poison with wine of God. On his high shining backs, also could ride, obviously, because of that. Tooth lay with delight in error's passionate arms, gliding downstream in a blithe gated barge. So it is moving in a barge which is having golden sails gliding. Means our thoughts our are only imitations of the truth. They are not really gold. Imitations of things. Could mingle, sorry, she uh, gliding downstream in a gilded, in a blithe gilded bar. She etched her ray with a magnificent lie. Here in life's neither realms all contraries made in spite of mind. To stares and does her works with bandaged eyes. <laughs> Truth is not true here and she cannot see it truly and ignorance is wisdom's patron here.
these galloping hooves in their enthusiastic speed could bear to a dangerous intimidate soul where death walks wearing a robe of deathless life dangerous intimidate soul that is what the giant head of life can lead you to it opens out but also it can lead you to dangerous intimidate in other places she also speaks of the valley of wandering gleam you get lost in the wandering gleam valley of wandering gleam in pilgrim's progress it is slow or despond despond you feel frustrated lost totally and then give up i think we'll take up that thing next time it's a lot big topic we'll review some of these things again but it's a big topic you see wandering the dangerous intimidate zone sir see a minor goddess which enchants which enchantress sorceress homer speaks of her as loveliest of all immortals <laughs> loveliest of all immortals daughter of helios she is the daughter of sun god himself helios had vast knowledge of drugs and herbs so she could give drug and poison you and drink also <laughs> or bring to life also <laughs> vast knowledge of drugs and herbs which man transformed her enemies into animals <laughs> but <laughs> <Pardon> yeah <laughs> that's what happened the crew of uh, odysseus yeah. turned into swine you see yeah sirs's mansion uh, in the dense world in the dense world would provide docile lions and wolves so all the lions and wolves are docile there of course her victims made so by her drugs and magic very powerful yeah worked out at huge loom so she is constantly working out at a huge loom odysseus crew feasted and turned into swines with a man after the occasion odysseus ventured with due precautionary instructions yet the precautionary instruction from his great grandfather hermes the god finally she suggested to him two routes to go to his ithaca he wanted to go back to his city ithaca so she guided him go like this like this like this, like this. he stayed with her for a couple of years and uh, they had relationship and all that you see <laughs> but finally uh, he he forgot about all that thing. i had to go back to my ithaca and then she did and showed her go like this go like that you see 